Hey Hoopers, Percolator here, and I'm going to teach you a move called the Tasty Freeze. Ta-da! How do you do a Tasty Freeze? Well, you can break it down to a couple simple components. First, we have the shoulder pass, and then you have a calf whip, and then finally, you have a wedgie into up escalator. The first thing we're going to work on is the shoulder pass into calf wedge. And this is really where all the magic happens, or doesn't quite work. What's happening is I'm going to do a shoulder pass, but instead of letting it pass all the way around, let it drop into the crook of my knee. So then you're here. This is where most people have trouble. Usually you need to wait a little bit longer than is comfortable to let it drop into your knee. So one more tap. As soon as it drops into your knee, it should easily flip over the top of you like this. So let's work on this calf wedge part by itself. I'm passing from my right shoulder, so I'm grabbing it with my left knee. So if you're doing it from your left shoulder, you probably want to grab it with your right knee. So, grab onto your hip like so, pinky's facing up. Bring it over the back of you like so. I'm going to let it come down so I can grab it with my leg. And when I grab it with my leg, it's going to hit against the back of my leg here. I'm just going to let it pop over. So once again, once again, let's go. And then we're here. Now, from here, you can wedge it into an up escalator, which I'm not going to cover in this because those are beasts all of their own. So, if we put it all together, it looks like so. Alright. Let's see it from the back. And once more from the side. And that's the end of my tutorial for the Tasty Freeze. Thank you guys for watching.